state finals here at the lab in Ypsilanti. We've had a couple hours of field events going on. We've had state championships earned in both boys and girls shot. Uh, the girls high jump, currently boys high jumps going and boys pole vault is currently trying to wrap things up. They started off with 30 pole vaulters, so it's taken a little bit of time. But on the track, we're gonna start with the women's four by 800 meter relay. There'll be like two sections of the girls relay. There's 11 teams in the first and 10 teams in the second. Four by eight, um, you got each member running 800 meters. The two mile relay, or the four by eight, whichever way you want to say it. Our 11 teams in this first section is Project 131, Chariots of Fire Track Club, Breen Track Club, B Force Track Club, Michigan Racers Track Club, Spear Dupree, Red Hawk Track Club, Blue Crew, Alma Track Club, Ann Arbor Track Club, Flatlander Landers. We've got 11 in this race. Uh, just a reminder, if you're just joining us, the top eight individuals or top eight relay teams are considered all state here at the MITS state finals. And we witnessed yesterday in, in multiple distance races, uh, seem to happen more often than the sprints, but in the distance races and relays, <clears throat> at least a few times, an all-state performance came out of the slower heat. So these teams, just because they're in the first heat, which is the slower heat, does not mean they can't be all-state. Usually the winner of this heat uh, will put themselves in at least contention if they're uh, willing to put themselves out there and race time. And we saw that yesterday in the, the open two-mile or open 3,200. We witnessed one boy and one girl get eighth place out of the slow heat. So... Uh, just because you're in this heat does not mean you can't have aspirations of being all state. We have Project 131 leading the way through the first few hundred meters of the race. Race is uh, strung out fairly quickly. Single files, they follow, uh, follow each other around. 11 teams in section one. Project 131 with the fastest seed time entering the, the race is holding true so far. <clears throat> Project 131 comes in today with a seed time of 10, 13, 99. And that just missed getting in the fast seat by about two seconds. But they're not in the lead right now. Handing off in the lead, I'll try to, it looks like Red Hawk Track Club. Red Hawk Track Club will hand off in the lead. I feel like they're being followed by Spirit of Pre-B and then Project 131. <coughs> The lead pack coming down the home stretch right now. Looks like Spirit of Repri is the new leader with Red Hawk, Red Hawk Track Club in second and Project 131 in third. So there's our top three. It's Spirit of Pre B, Red Hawk Track Club, and Project 131.
And as we come across the common finish line here, uh, our leader still speared a pre B. The three, the three team race has turned into a four team race. Maybe Breen, Breen Track Club. No, but it's not Breen. And they've handed off to the third leg. Spear to Priest B is still in the lead. Not quite sure on the team in second. It's a pink jersey with, uh, it almost reminded me of a Romeo team, but I don't think that's it. <clears throat> I think that is, looks like now that I see it, B Force Track Club. So B Force Track Club has moved into second. They had a nice uh, second leg. They got them from about fifth into second, and then um, still got Project 131 in the top four and Red Hawk Track Club. <clears throat> Still, our leader is Pre, Spirit of Pre B, B Force Track Club, Red Hawk Track Club, and Project 131. We have two more teams working their way into the mix. Chariots of Fire is one of those working their way up. <clears throat> Our leaders are going to come around and they're going to hand off to the final leg of this first heat of the 4x800 meter relay. Speeder Pre B still holding on to a little lead over B Force Track Club, who's in second with Red Hawk Track Club and Project 131. And the handoffs are clean. <clears throat> B-Force Track Club had a great second and third leg to get themselves in contention here. So as we have the, the beginning of the final leg, you've got a, a really a two-team race right now. Spear to Pre-B still hanging on to the lead by a couple meters over B-Force Track Club. And then we have a three race lead or three team race for third place. Project 131 in third, Red Hawk Track Club, and potentially Blue Crew. Not really sure what that jersey top said. I don't think it's Blue Crew though, because back in the little bit, a couple other spots back was the Blue Crew. And they're hitting the bell lap, and we have a new leader. B Force Track Club taking the lead over Spirit of Pre. Project 131 still in third.
And we got a tight race coming down the finish. We got a little bit of a change in, in second place. <clears throat> Just a touch under 10. Look like, look like maybe a 9.54 unofficial, 9.55 unofficially. And the winner is B-Force Track Club.